trade is the backbone of the city. Then excellent service has been developed around it and continue to be developed, allowing businesses to flourish. Today, more than 200 Fortune 500 companies are based in Dubai. This area was the trading hub. The creek was the central for that. And then it developed slowly, slowly, then became Sheikh Zayed Road as a new downtown. It's a nice thing to see the city is developing, but this is where it all started. We started in November of 97. The Jumeirah Beach Hotel, the Burj Al Arab were already under construction. I was invited on board to set up the company. We had a porter cabin where we had our office <laughs> to start with. At the moment, we have 15 hotels, and it looks like if everything goes according to plan by mid-2012, we will actually be operating 23 hotels across the world. When we attract foreign direct investment, they look at the bigger region. 2.2 plus billion people, almost one third of the global population. We've been trading with India for hundreds of years. India is the largest trading nation with the UAE. This is a huge catchment market for any multinational. Dubai is good from a telecoms infrastructure standpoint. We can deliver content to our customers in a very reliable way, which obviously helps to support our customers who are trading that financial information. The richness of the talent pool you've got available in Dubai. It's been a major attraction for many years for the financial markets. The DIFC, which we think is probably the most important institution within the region because it's attracted all the finance houses and the people who are associated with the banks and insurance companies, etc., into the UAE. So they have been extremely successful at creating Dubai from nothing into a business and particularly a financial services hub. We have over 110 different nationalities uh, working for us. So our colleagues represent so many different countries around the world. For example, we, we have quite a number of Chinese people working for us here. So it's great for our guests to know that they can, that, that somebody who speak their language, make them feel at home, make them feel comfortable. In 2005, we had 18 Chinese companies. Today, we are over 2,000. Around 50% of Chinese imported crude oil is waterborne from Middle East. We're thinking to expand our, our business here with the producers to meet with Chinese uh, demand. We're going to expand our office size here to have a closer relationship with the producers. One of the great features of Dubai and the hallmarks of Dubai has been its ability to be able to bring the product to market so quickly. Ten years ago, there was about two million people coming here. Now we have eight million people. The airport is already up to 50 million travelers a year. Dubai is going through a very interesting experiment, which I think the rest of the world will look at very closely. It's bringing immigration in here to generate uh, revenue and grow the economy in a very significant way. People recognize Dubai as a global city, an enabling city. That's what Dubai is all about. Enabling people, enabling business, enabling life.